Hi Virgos, welcome to my channel. We're doing your... I hope you guys can see me. Okay, uh, <laughs> it's still working on the light thing. Um, welcome to my channel. We're doing your November 6 to 12. This is a Scorpio month, so it's going to be exposing a lot of stuff. That's what I'm trying to do. Anyhow, um, and uh, yeah, that's it in this standard reading. Here we're going to see the situation that you guys are in. So let's see what's going on for the Virgo. Sun, Moon, and Rising. There we go. Okay. You have your Seven of Wands restriction. Either you're restricting some sort of connection with the person, someone is blocking someone off, someone is... You could be blocking this person, or they're blocking you, or you're blocking other people. No, this is the energy right now because it's either you have worked a lot for this thing to manifest and then there are other people who are just throwing out shade and it's like oh this not person is not meant for you da 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 and then you're like uh uh no I trust myself I work hard on this this is it for me I'm here and I'm gonna continue you know? can be a stubborn energy so this is gonna be you or this uh, other person you know the soulmate that you have very very restrictive though strong determined a fighter you know it's like i will do this you know it's like i will do this at all costs and you have your the higher fan can be a taurus but this energy is about the union right this is a harmonious look at all the animals over there um this is a harmonious connection a divine connection also this is you feeling like oh everything is just feeling right you know, because this is a blessing from the divine. The, the understanding that you have is different. The the concept of love you have right now is different. The concept that you feel for this person is different. So hence, nobody can understand you. You know, we do connect with each and every individual. You know, different. So this is what you're feeling, or this person is going through. I mean, both of you right now. But there, I'm sensing here. There's a lot of questions. Okay. Let me see here. Is it trader for the first? Oof. And this is of another restriction, Four of Pentacles. But the energy over here is like giving what you can have, what you have extra, what you have that you know that you are able to let go. Um, this is also a self-sacrifice. Only on this card, on this this deck, self-sacrifice because I mean I don't have a lot, but here. You can have this. This is you being vulnerable also. This is different, again, this is a different Four of Pentacles. You're being vulnerable because you see that, you know, like this can be a possibility. I'm willing to take the risk. You are very much, you know, concerned though of yourself. That's why you have the blockage of other people. Yeah, no, 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 you know, that kind of energy. Can be another earth sign and a fire sign over here. This can be also a moment where nobody's talking. I just said nobody's talking. And you have your Four of Swords. Nobody talking, really. Um, going within, trying to understand, thinking of the person through and through. Did I make the right decision? I feel safe, yes, but is this going to be a situation where I was before? So it can be someone transpired already before. That's why you have a tendency to also discuss. If you shut down, they shut down also. And then nobody really talks here. It's like, you know, and then there's a slight, you know, slight movement. It's an opening. Someone grabs it and then they take, you know, they talk again. Um, so this person, because you guys have this different connection and it's like you, you can't define it. I mean, I know this is not the lover's card. You can't define it. But what I'm sensing with, with the Hierophant energy here, because with all the harmonious, um, you know, energies with, with the animals, you're very much connected with the person regardless of the differences that you guys have there. Ooh, it's a lot. So much downloads <laughs> and then you have your death card with a Scorpio I just said you know this is the season so this is the new cycle a new beginning you know this energy from what I'm sensing is is like you either you tried to cut this person off before and then they came back in a different way in a different form that's why people are already saying it's like no don't no don't you know it's like you they hurt you before why you trust them again you know four of swords uh, there was a heartache there was a breakup you know if not, this is currently happening. That this is, there's going to be a breakup, only to only to have something new again. You have your the emperor, a strong Aries energy, or another fire sign. This is when things are established and very much in control. Someone here is a control freak, but they lost control. 
because the four of pentacles here is again is giving out something so if they weren't giving before now they are about to give out some you know some sort of attention um but they're gonna do it only because it is right it's not about addressing feelings or emotion. It's not going to address your feelings. It's going to address what is right. Oh, you haven't been this to me. Okay, then I'll do it for you. But where is the connection there? Because there's no water energy here for love. It's more about healing, opening up, and just trusting in the connection. That's what I'm sensing here. So, Virgos, I'm going to continue this reading on how this, you know, I'm sorry, on the exposure of your soulmate's true feelings towards you. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful, wonderful week.